Well, this week's the launch of the, uh, the Joint Firearms Training, which is David Paris, South Wales and Gwent. And uh, as the DCC for Gwent, I've led on that for the, uh, the last year. But I think it's a testament to the special relationship, really, we've got across Gwent, South Wales and David. And, and having been a South Wales officer for 25 years, you know, I know the force very well. I think this is going to give us a real opportunity. And I, I think most of our staff would say it's madness that we train. We've got three firearms ranges, we've got three firearms trainers, we all do things differently. They'd have to say this is absolutely ridiculous us wouldn't they? You, you get a, a consistency across three forces. We do, we do assist other forces out from time to time and in the past we've had issues with radio channels regardless of actually meeting the officers, getting to speak to them on the same channel was tricky enough. So now we, we, we're just now going through the process of aligning all our radios, our kit and equipment, all the officers will work the same uh, and that covers virtually all of South Wales. This isn't a merger, it's a million miles from a merger. We're not looking at uh, the three forces coming together. That's not, there's no political imperative behind that uh, from either Welsh Government or from uh, the Home Office. But what it is, is a chance to say local policing is local, but what we can do is ensure that specialist resources, whether they be firearms, specialist crime, scientific support, we can brigade them together and we can do them as one. And it's common sense, isn't it? It's absolutely common sense. But people will start to see David Powers officers Gwent officers patrolling South Wales areas and deploying the firearms incidents. We can train uh, firearms officers initially uh, together so that we get our tactics, our response, our kit equipment vehicles and training in line with one another to provide uh, a much wider response across a much wider area uh, with the resources we've got. Yesterday was the, the first day of joint training between all the three forces so at the moment we've got David, Gwent and South Wales officers now training together. Um, for the first time. Um, so we've got a 10 week session now where we'll put all uh, 240 through the same training package. This is a good example of us saving a lot of money. So over the next uh, year we're going to be saving nearly a three quarters of a million pounds across the three forces. Um, improving our service, so our things like our tactical team are going to grow, uh, we'll have more opportunities for deployment, uh, but making this more interoperable, so we do the same things together. But I have absolutely every confidence that we will deliver the service in a better, more professional way as we move forward.